We're counting down to Christmas today, but it's the Hub City's kickoff to Christmas, and it's happening tonight. Spartanburg hosting its 26th annual Dickens of a Christmas, and that's where we find Fox Carolina's Carrie Weimer getting in the holiday spirit, of course, and it looks like you have a guest with you. I do. I have a very special guest with me. She's kind of the woman behind the whole Dickens of a Christmas. She won't take the credit, but we're going to give it to her because she's been out here working nonstop today to make sure this event goes off without a hitch tonight. So, Miss Mandy Merck, let me introduce you. Please tell us what a Dickens of a Christmas is all about. Oh my gosh, the Dickens of a Christmas is the city of Spartanburg's Victorian Holiday Festival. And in just a, uh, what are we, just a little less than an hour away now, the street will just be filled with tons of people and carolers will be going up and down the road and there'll be horse-drawn carriage rides and train rides and food and, and it's even going to be snowing right over there. So I heard. I feel like it can be snowing right I here. I feel like it could be. It is cold, but it is cold. not as cold as it could be. So, hey, it's supposed to be cold because it's Christmas time. This is true. It kind of goes with the whole theme of everything. Yes, it, fits, it does. Right? It does. Let's talk about the people that want to come out tonight. If you're watching now, you need to just go ahead and start getting ready. Come on out. Let's talk about the different foods and the different entertainment form as well. Yes, we have. There is so much to do from Denny's all the way down to the Herald Journal and then over on Broad Street. We have about 60 stops that people could make if they have time to fit it all in. And you may be going inside one of the downtown shops where there might be handbells and letters to Santa. You might be stopping at a stage out on the street or the risers where you'll have school groups caroling. And then we have tons of food vendors offering everything from Broadway. I like that look. Uh, yeah, from bratwurst to, to funnel cakes to pork chops out on the street. Oh uh, you can even sample the German mulled glue vine right behind us here. With I don't know what that is, but it I sounds know, good. But it is, and it's warm and toasty. So lots of hot chocolate out here. There's ice skating going on, the carriage rides. Um, there's just so much to see and do. And so we do. We get started at 6, and it goes to 9. And one of the highlights of the evening is the tree lighting at Denny's Tower, which takes place pretty much right Right on the dot at 7:30, we have a big countdown and 10:98, uh, and and then we then it comes on and everybody oozes and ahs. Then who pulls that switch? Well, it's one of Santa's elves. Oh, yep. Okay. We can't. So we, we sure. can't. We can't. No, okay. no, no, no. I just thought maybe if you needed extra help. Well, you know. and then there's always um, there's security there in case Scrooge shows up and tries to stop it, but it's never happened so far in 26 years. Speaking of Scrooge. You told me earlier there are some very special guests that people might run into out here. Who would that be? Oh, yes. You may see um, Scrooge walking down the street. You may see Bob Marley. You, Bob Marley? <laughs> Not Bob Marley. What? <laughs> Not Bob. Well, hey, you, you never, never know. know. Bob Marley. What's the Marley? name it's not Bob anyway you know the Marley not Bob Marley from although again he could be here you never know uh, you might see Elsa you may see Anna you may see the Grinch we have just a ton of characters literally characters that will be walking around lots of just crazy characters walking around as well so plenty of stuff to do tonight bring the whole family out there's something here for everybody like she said refreshments entertainment music there's so much and you've got all these streets blocked off so there's plenty of room for everybody yes. so and I'm gonna tell you the streets will be wall to wall with people soon so it, it's a great fun holiday tradition that is amazing and maybe it'll be a little warmer with all those people yes it Who will knows? it will so come on out to downtown spartanburg take a journey back into time and just enjoy yourself tonight live in spartanburg carrie weimer fox carolina the five o'clock news thank you carrie we were all getting a little laugh in there with bob marley no it just kind of comes out that way but we did look it's jacob and roberts bob marley. you know easy to get confused